Here we go again. It is currently 90 degrees outside and uh, this is the fit. This is the outfit. What was Cassie thinking? I don't know. I'm kind of burning up, but I just low-key feel like a mood right now. So, hey, what's up? So basically at this point in my YouTube career, I have been doing a what's in my backpack video pretty much every year. So even though I have absolutely no idea whether I'm going back to school online or in person, I still thought it would be a great idea to spend all of my money on school supplies that I don't even know if I'm going to be using. Let's get started. So this is gonna be my backpack for this year. Now I don't get a new backpack every year because you know, you gotta save that money. Last year my backpack like completely fell apart which Loki made me cry when it happened because it was literally my favorite backpack in the entire world and it was 20 bucks probably makes sense why it fell apart. But anyways, this is my backpack for this year. It's pretty plain, but I really like the color and I think it'll go with a lot of things. The first thing I have is pretty standard. I'm gonna just get it out of the way. I have this white spiral notebook. I think it's college ruled. I don't know if that really matters. I'm thinking I might just get a bunch of stickers off of Redbubble and then stick them onto here. That's the plan. Going along with the whole white background thing, the next thing we have is this white folder, but I decided to do something cool with it. I took an orange Sharpie and just drew a bunch of cool designs on it. You know what? I am very proud of myself. I'm not afraid to say it. Although it did take me like the whole movie of Emperor's New Groove to actually finish it. So there's that. I think it was worth it. The next thing we got is this really cool binder. It's like my favorite thing in the world. It used to be like a plain white binder. Like I said, I like to start with a white base and just be creative with it. It's just a really cool collage and I just love the aesthetic of it. It's literally my baby at this point. And I also have this part that says autumn 2020 and then I'll just like change it up for the different seasons. So now we're going into the next zipper pouch. We got this spiral composition notebook, but it actually says like decomposition notebook. I don't know. I thought it looked really cool. I also just really love that this whole notebook, all the pages and everything are all made from recycled materials. That makes me really happy that I get to help out the environment along with having a cute notebook. The next thing, of course, we have another white base. I'm definitely gonna spice this up later because it has a pocket in the front so I can add like a cute collage or something to it. Overall, I just really like the set up of this planner because most planners I feel like they're made to be cute but like that's kind of it you know what I'm saying I'm just really hoping that it'll actually keep me productive this year <laughs> so next we have these pens and pencils not too exciting but I'm gonna run through them because these are my absolute favorite pens and pencils definitely recommend <laughs> the first one is the classic 0.7 mechanical pencil honestly these are just kind of a go-to I don't really need to explain it <laughs> the next thing we got is the iconic papermate 0.7 mechanical pencils that look like this you guys all know what I'm talking about. I feel like if you have these pencils, everybody will be jealous of you because come on, nobody can deny it. These are the best mechanical pencils. I had to pick up some. These pens. Okay, can we take a second and talk about these pens? Because these pens are the best thing in the entire world. I'm going to tell you guys the name of these pens so you can go and write it down so you can remember it later, okay? These are the Papermate Enjoy Gel Pens in the 0.7 millimeter point. These are amazing, guys. I will not use any other pens now. This next thing is not exciting at all, but I'm a high school student, so I needed index cards. Enough said. This next pouch in the backpack is just all of my like emergency stuff that I might need at school. This is just what I have that aren't necessarily like school supply related, but they're definitely things that I might need at school. So we got the classic gum, a little pack of tissues, sports piece chapstick, and some lip gloss, some hair ties, and then of course this super cute scrunchie, some money in case I need to buy lunch or something, my AirPods, which now that I own them, I cannot go a day without them. Definitely need these. And then we have the most important thing in this entire backpack. Uh, okay, that was maybe too much, but um, hand sanitizer, you need some hand sanitizer. And then the last one out of the four pouches, I just have a bunch of highlighters. So I have my midliner highlighters, my classic yellow highlighter that I love to death, and then this really cool red highlighter. See, I kind of want to say that it's not a good idea to have a highlighter this dark of a color because it'll like cover up whatever you're trying to highlight, but I mean, I bought it, so obviously they still got my money, so. That is everything that I have in my backpack. Thank you guys so, so much for watching, especially if you stay to the end. That seriously means the absolute world to me. If you enjoyed watching this video and you wanna see more content from this pretty cool person right here, then you should definitely subscribe and follow my Instagram. But that is definitely enough self-promo for one day, so I'll see you guys next time. Bye. Love you.